Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to uh, Training Reviews. So, I'm just taking a video of the uh, Samsung S10 Plus and the uh, DJI Osmo Pocket. So, I'm doing a comparison of the stabilization. So, I've got the uh, front cameras and I've turned the Osmo Pocket around uh, to selfie mode just to see how the stabilization is. So, rather than checking the quality of the video, this is hopefully give you an idea of actually how stable the video is as well. So, the Osmo Pocket is a free axis gimbal and the uh, S10 Plus comes with a dual optical image stabilization feature. And I've heard really good things about the S10 Plus, so I just wanted to do a side-by-side -side comparison. I'll use the, uh, the back camera and the front camera. I'll go down steps, up steps, just to give you a bit of variation. So hopefully uh, you guys can get an idea of which one's more smoother. So let's just get straight into it. Where you move, make me blind. You will always be there. There's no doubt in my mind. You will always be the heading out to see ya and leave the rest behind. Oh, oh, oh. Cause you will always be the oh, oh, oh. Cause you will always be the one to hold me. You will always be the one who knows me. You will always be come on, let me closer to your heart. So that was the uh, video comparisons. So I was holding both the Osmo Pocket and the S10 Plus in my hand. I didn't have any of them on a tripod. I was just walking normally with the phone and the Osmo Pocket out in front of me. So the Osmo Pocket, it does actually uh, come specifically for the purpose of having stabilized footage. Especially in locked mode, you're gonna get the smoothest uh, video possible, very cinematic views. But I find that the S10 Plus, if I was going to keep both of these devices, I would sell the Osmo Pocket and just use the S10 for the uh, stabilization feature on the uh, video quality. I think it does an excellent job. It's one of the best stabilized uh, OIS I've seen on any smartphone currently. And uh, I would just use that going forwards. Now, of course, the Osmo Pocket comes with a lot more features when you connect it to your device, whether it's an iPhone or an Android phone. So you can do various different modes and uh, the uh, video on the uh, S10 is just one specific mode. So it depends on what you want, but for me I'm going to keep the S10 Plus and I'll use the Osmo Pocket a lot less now because I'm very happy with the stabilization on the S10 as well. So let me know what you guys think, hopefully that was useful. If you have any comments, if you want me to review anything else, do let me know. Otherwise I hope you subscribe, I hope you like this video and I will catch you guys at the next comparison videos. Take care. I'm waiting here for you Yeah, you Yeah, I know, I know You will always be there